have to ask this because you did uh, right in the beginning talk about how the idea for Dulos began. But then when I started thinking about your band name, I'm thinking, that is so random. First off, I was like, what does that word even mean? So I had to even do some homework. And uh, clearly, you know, Dulos doesn't have an agenda to beat people over the head with Christianity. But the band's name is a Greek term used in the Old Testament, meaning slave. And the only reason why I mentioned this is, like, literally last year, there was a California post-hardcore band named Slaves, who literally, last year, in June, I would say, July, it became national news, even for a band that's not on the global stage of, let's say, Metallica, right? But they decided to change their name due to its perceived ties to racism, even though the founder, Johnny Craig, who later got kicked out of the band, named the band after his battle with substance abuse, basically saying, I'm enslaved to the addiction. So Rebel Mel, you know, as someone who is in a Christian hardcore band, why, what do you say to the listeners who might question the band's name Dulos today, now knowing what the reference means, slave to Christ? Like, what, what does that mean to you? Well, I mean, I think we, you're only going to give me a couple of minutes. So, and we're also <laughs> going to be widely talking to a um, platform of people that are obviously not Christian. And so to give a, an understanding in such a short duration of time is going to be a little limited, but the best way that I can give it to you is the fact, you know, if you're going to take it in just the uh, context of uh, slave being this English word that's able to be easily translated. And then if you take doulos, which is not easily translated because it does derive from the Greek and it actually means bondservant. And mm. so considering the fact that, you know, you have to understand that it comes from a understanding that yet while I was still a sinner, Christ died for me and that I have the understand that or the understanding that, you know, he loved me so much that he gave his life for me. And so in response to that, you know, I choose to follow him and to be a, a messenger of his good word because of that. I think that's a great answer to it. I mean, truthfully, when I saw that slaves changed their name last year, I'm, li I'm literally thinking, all because of the movement that's happening today with Black Lives Matter. You never had a problem with it the first time you came up with the name, and then now it's a problem? And even put it into a bigger context, mm -hmm. the Dixie Chicks been rocking the name for 20 years. It's never been a problem. But yeah. ever since now, with the conceived notion, you know, that everything has to tie with what today's uh, going through, I think it's just wrong. And you're basically taking things out of context, which don't be doing that with this band, all right? 